Welcome back. Families from across the Capital Region are set to gather this week for the first ever Parent of the Year Awards. The event will recognize more than 20 area residents for their parenting skills and love of their children. The event is the idea of TV show host Paula Gretzinger, and she joins us now to share more. Thanks for stopping by, Paula. Thank you for having me. Uh, th this is a really exciting event. I know you're really excited about, about hosting this event. Talk to me about how the idea came about. Well, the idea happened because I, I do the TV show, Parentology, and I've been interviewing parents for the past three years. And it's interesting that parents tell me, oh my God, it's, you know, it's so much work and, and it's such a thankless job. And I want them to know that it's really not because they are, they're, they're heroes. I mean, we as parents were teaching the leaders of tomorrow, you know, so I think they need to feel good about themselves. And you see all these events happening, these fundraisers for, you know, all these different people. And I thought, you know what? here's a group of people that really need to be recognized so that's when I decided you know what I'm gonna have a parent of the year awards dinner for everybody uh, you know you're you're awarding over 20 area residents yes. talk to me about what you were looking for in these different parents because I know there's a, a, a gamut of categories right yes I when I decided to come up with this I said I can't just have one parent it can't just be one parent that wouldn't be fair because again from interviewing all these different parents throughout the three years there are single parents there are parents of disabled children uh, grandparents so I said how can a grandparent for example compete with a single parent and how can a single mom compete with a single dad so that's where I basically it took me a week and uh, I even put polls on Facebook to try to get an idea from the parents and I came up with all the different categories and within those categories I said okay this one has to be for mom and dad mom and dad and then I have two awards that are for couples and then I said I need to have something funny now something different and that's when I went into the funniest parent the most organized and uh, no one actually nominated anyone for the funniest really no one so, Most kids don't think their parents are funny, obviously. I don't know. I don't know if they were shy or what, but I was surprised yeah. because I thought we'd have a lot of people. We've received over 100 nominations, and uh, nobody nominated anyone for the funniest parent, so we need to work on that. You know, you gave us some of the, uh, the categories, but highlight somebody specifically that when you were looking at all these people that were nominated that really stood out to you and you said, wow, this is a really deserving person. Well, there was one in particular, uh, the Survivor Award. And um, we, at first, we had the, this event scheduled for November. But because of the holidays, I didn't want it to be a stressful thing for parents. I wanted it to be an event where parents would come and have fun. So we... Um, had this one particular mom that had over 20 nominations and she's she's battling cancer and she's she's dying and the doctors told her she's not gonna have a lot of time left so her kids when we contacted them and said you know your mom won but we're switching the date they were actually very worried because they said you know this is gonna mean so much for my mom and we would have mailed her we kept checking with her to, to check on her status because we would have presented the award to her yeah. before. Probably um, means a lot to the kids as well. It does. To let it their does. mother know how much they care for her. Obviously, your parent, your kids are here with you tonight. Uh, how important was it for you to do this? It, it was very important. And I had people, <laughs> parents reach out to me and say, can I, can I nominate you? I said, no, you can't because I'm the one who's putting this stuff together. And uh, I don't need an award because tomorrow is going to be the award, you know, seeing all the different parents there and, and the energy and getting people excited over it and making people feel special because I know what it's like, you know, to be a parent. I know what it's like to be a single parent and it's, it's not easy to juggle everything and uh, try to smile, you know, still. So I want, I want parents to know it's really, really important what they're doing and they need to feel good about it. Yeah, give us some of the award ceremony details. It's happening tomorrow night in Rexford. Yes, it's happening tomorrow night at the Mohawk River Country Club in Chateau on uh, Riverview Road in Rexford from 6 to 10. And uh, anyone can attend the event. Uh, right now we have 65 people, but um, and we weren't going to sell any more tickets. But people have been calling asking, can we go? Can we go? 
anyone can go. So they can buy the tickets right at the door tomorrow, starting at 6 o'clock. The dinner starts at 7, and then the award presentation starts at 8 o'clock. And, of course, we said uh, quickly, TV show host as well. You're, you, uh, tell folks just a little bit about your TV show. And it, it, obviously, it's on a... It, it, can be seen locally. Yes, my TV show is a half hour t parenting show. It's been on for three years now and um, I, actually one of my production staff, he is from here, from Queensbury, so okay. he's probably watching us right now. But um, we have clips on YouTube from different episodes that have aired and basically I have uh, experts on doctors talking about different topics because one of the things that I notice is parents are afraid to talk about certain things but I want them to know it's okay. It's okay to say that your kid is ADHD because our expert is going to help us with that. That sounds great. Paula Gretzinger, thank you so much for stopping by. We thank appreciate you. it. Good luck tomorrow night. Thank you. Now to find out more about the Parent of the Year Awards, also Paula Show Parentology, and see our conversation for a second time, head to the website. It's looktvonline.com. We've posted it all right there.